respected students welcome back everyone so as you have seen the thumbnail and title of the video so today's video is about the five interview tips which i am going to give from my personal experience for conquering the interviews and that five interview tips which i am going to give that my personal experience is all about the interviews which i have given okay for securing the job the second is the mock interview which i have taken on the subscribers and the real time interviews which i have taken in the companies okay so so many of interviews i have given so the five tips which will definitely you will get a dream job for as a data analyst or especially as a power bi developer that five tips i am going to give in this video okay so now let's start with the video but if you are new on our channel make sure to subscribe and press bell icon for all upcoming videos and follow us on instagram ठीक है सो द फाइव टिप्स विच आर देयर सी द फर्स्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टिप विच इज देयर बिफोर द इंटरव्यू लाइक लेट से वॉट आई डू आई विल टेल यू फ्रॉम माई पर्सनल एक्सपीरियंस वॉट आई डू लेट से माई इंटरव्यू इज स्केड्यूल फ्रॉम वन पी एम टू वन थर्टी और वन फोर्टी फाइव ओके वन पी एम टू वन थर्टी इफ माई इंटरव्यू इज स्केड्यूल्ड देन वन आवर बिफोर I take complete rest and before interview, uh, two hours before the interview, like 11 a.m. to 12 p.m., I do revision. If my interview is scheduled at 1 p.m., so from 11 p.m. to uh, 11 a.m. to 12 p.m., I do revision, and from 12 p.m. to 1 p.m., complete rest I take. Okay, so see before interview, your brain should be complete means uh, it should not have any rush or anything. it should be completely fresh you should go to the interview confidently okay so between 11 am to 12 pm that one hour what i do revision now i will tell you what i do so see i have uh, written many notes on my note uh, in my notebook so i have one notebook uh, three 300 pages notebook is there and uh, in that i have written many uh, notes so basically i just do revision go through that notes in that half an hour and next half an hour i see all the pbx file the tax queries which i have written little bit of modeling and sql queries okay so this half half hour bracket i have done half uh, 30 minutes notes in the notebooks which i have written or any printable notes which i have and 30 minutes dax formulas modeling and sql queries okay so this is the best tip many i would guarantee that at least 70% of candidates don't do revision proper revision second tip is Ah, uh, second tip. This as an interview panelist, I will give you. Let's see. I have taken interviews of many candidates. So what I have seen now that candidates come uh, memorize the answer and come like see there are a few questions like what is the difference between import mode, direct query, star schema, snowflake schema. These are the some of the eight ten questions which definitely any panelist is going to ask you. So in this case, so these questions are actually a golden opportunity for you. But many candidates, what they do? that they just memorize the answer they completely speak no no expression on face and anything it is clearly visible that he has memorized the he she has memorized the answer and he is only speaking okay it is clearly visible as a panelist i am telling but when i ask one simple question like uh, if you have taken data from import mode and uh, direct query also now which pbx file size will be more so there the candidate is not able to answer it properly because the thing is he has just memorized that answer uh, okay you need to understand the concept what is import direct query what is star schema snowflake schema in star schema definitely less data will be there in snowflake more data will be there what is pro premium what is license and all those things this concept data modeling one to many means what you have to understand the concept that vinayak has went to a mall he has purchased four things now vinayak is a one person and those are four things like pen pencil mobile so vinayak will come as a primary he is a one person and he has purchased four products that is many products he has purchased that will be one to many you are just memorizing so it is not going to help memorizing i am not saying memorizing answer is wrong thing even i have done multiple times but when you are giving the answer only it should be visible that 20 30% you have memorized 70% rest 70% core your concepts it should come like what is your understanding what is your concept understanding that should be visible to panelist so if this thing will be visible if he is asking logical scenario based question also then also you will be able to answer the thing that's the power of understanding the concepts okay core concept science i am saying 
any round it is whether it is manager round technical round or logical scenario based round if your concepts are clear at least 78 percent any type of question whether he is asking at least 50 percent answer you will be able to give okay so please try to understand the concepts and you are memorizing uh, focus should be only 20 30 percent okay now coming to the third point so before that just i want to tell you that see uh, if you want to book one-on-one -on -one call with me so i have launched my top med page also their career guidance mock interview no uh, linkedin resume review interview preparation trip tips all so hundreds of booking has happened with 4.9 rating many candidates have read that so if you want one on call with me you can go to my top med, top med page and book the call from there link is there in description okay so third point is all about uh, soft skill that is confidence communication see average interview time is like 30 to 45 minutes mostly 30 minutes interviews are there okay so the most important thing that at the start of interview the first minute and the last minute you should have the same confidence let me tell you one thing at least see whenever i evaluate that at least 40 percent part i give to soft skills and i bid on the candidate this i have told in my several videos also past videos that soft skills are quite important so throughout the 30 minutes or 45 minutes complete interview if the confidence is seen on the face of candidate he is able to communicate properly okay and face the interview let me tell you from my personal experience as an interview panelist only 70 percent of candidates are able to face 30 minutes of video, uh, interview rest 30 uh, rest 30 percent candidates quit the interview in between only okay so if you are able to face at least 30 percent of can, uh, interview properly you have you are in that 70 percent part okay so this is main thing so first thing is confident you should be there throughout the interview no matter what type of questions will be there if your concepts are okay at least i can guarantee you from 20 questions 15 14 15 questions you will definitely answer at least you will try to answer you will understand the question if you are understanding the questions of interview panelists that is also a very big thing let me tell you one thing okay i have seen as a panelist that sometimes i am asking question he is even not understanding the question even after repeating second time so when your concepts are okay okay and if you are able to face all the questions properly and from 20 15 questions answers you are given definitely will be selected so that confidence communication attitude presentation everything should be seen properly throughout the uh, your interview i'm not saying it should be perfect your communication should be perfect like a uk us guy even my communication is not that perfect like a western uh, person okay but at least your confidence see as an indian uh, we all are frankly speaking as an indian we are all quite confident so directly face the camera and be confident don't be afraid of that panelist he is not going to kill you or he is not going to do anything at the end what will happen you will be rejected from the interview but nothing is going to happen but be confident confidence is the most important thing in interview don't take tension nothing whether you are you have converted experience or anything else is there be confident no no one is going to come and kill you nothing is going to happen but be confident in your communication try to speak okay but let's say if he is asking any different question and you are not able to answer it directly say that i don't know this concept or i am not able to recall it uh, right at the moment that this also you can say but from 20 questions for two three questions only tell this thing otherwise for every question if you will tell then definitely they will reject you okay so uh, coming to fourth point huh? see fourth point is quite important this many candidates will not able to do but uh, i do when i give interview see rather than interview make it interaction okay rather than interview make it interaction and uh, the reason is because if you will be friendly with your uh, interview panelist and if your interaction is going on properly definitely that uh, even that panelist who is taking interview he is only going to work with you he she whatever the panelist so if he will like uh, your 30 minutes of interview and rather than interview interaction is happening he will definitely think that i am loving to speak with this candidate if definitely he will if he will come in my team as a junior developer or whatever definitely he will like it so this is also the main thing if you want to conquer the interview okay so rather than interview make it interaction and how to make it so in that case see uh, tell your personal experience of what you have faced in your project difficulties how you tackled it or 
ask him some some of the question at the end of the interview that one uh, next video i'm going to make on that only but uh, tell about the kpis how additional values you have provided in the project what new things you have done certifications take some uh, or ask him only that what additional things you are doing or what about ai and all those things like little bit of try to make it interactive section rather than he is asking question and you are giving answer no okay the fifth point is the most important point uh, at the start of interview only i should have told this thing that watch till the end video see interviewer will think 10 times before rejecting you if you are strong in data modeling if you are strong in dax understanding like time intelligence and all those things logical and uh, third thing is bi service understanding and sql queries if you are strong in these four things okay data modeling is heart of power bi okay this i have told many times in video nowadays people are also writing this line or uh, on linkedin also many people are writing writing great thing so data modeling is heart of power bi and uh, if you are strong in data modeling second is dax logical understanding i am not saying that completely you should be perfecting uh dax but time intelligence logical functions and all those things if you are able to tackle the logic okay this thing third is bi service not complete bi service okay i would say complete data modeling you should know proper core concept but in bi service only gateway schedule refresh app workspace this six seven topics are fine and sql in sql joins sub query if that uh, panelist will see that you are strong in this four thing mark my words here as a panelist i'm saying and i have also given many interviews mark my word here that he will definitely not reject you he will think 10 times before rejecting you if he see that you are strong in these four things okay so in the interview if these questions are asked make sure you are literally perfect in these four things and you are able to means completely impress that panelist okay so these were the five points uh, five interview tips which i have given as a panelist also and uh, whatever interviews i have given so thanks for watching till end everyone and please subscribe and press bell icon for all upcoming videos and follow us on social media and you can watch other playlist also those have literally help many candidates even that will help you also thanks everyone